Hello and welcome to Growing With Plot 21. If you're new here, my name is Mark and today is day three of Transforming the Plot. I'm just in the car at the moment because it's a bit cold out again. Um, highs of seven or six degrees today. But if you can see next to me, I have brought some cardboard because we've just had a delivery of wood chip. So the plan today is to redo all the paths and then plant out the garlic that I bought from the RHS. I've got some normal garlic and some elephant garlic. So let's get going. A nice wood chip delivery for me to do the pass with. Hopefully I'll use quite a lot of that. Let's get on the plot and crack on. We have a little visitor. He's new, or she. Don't know him before. Is he gonna sit and watch what we get up to? Maybe you can give us a hand. So I think we're going to plant the garlic out first. I'd like to plant it in this bed over here um, because it's all done now. So we'll get the garlic out first. The um, green manure is doing really well as well. So let's see how that continues. This is just the trial bed for the green manure. We'll see how that goes. Let's grab the garlic and get planting. The garlic I've brought with me to plant out is the soft neck firmidrome French garlic. Insert there hopefully and then the elephant garlic um, as well so we're going to use this bed to make the garlic um to plant the garlic out so i'm just going to get rid of the pumpkin and tidy it up a little bit and then i'm going to try and keep the weed membrane on and grow the garlic in little holes and then it'll help with weeding so let's see if that works Okay, so I'm going to do two lots of the elephant garlic at the back and then I'm going to do two rows of eight, I think, um, in between the blue piping. I'm going to cut a little hole in the weed membrane fabric and hopefully that will stop it from um, overgrowing with weeds. So let's trial it with this bed and see what happens. open up just do a dig a hole yeah let's try this one as well I'm gonna do a do a line and then I'm gonna secure it down like I have been doing remember this is the this is the no dig bed so it's got some decent soil in it seven I managed to get seven let it breathe I think okay so that's the garlic So we've got garlic here, garlic here, and then elephant garlic there. So we'll see how that goes. Let's see if the experiment works or not. If it doesn't work, we'll know for next time. Okay, so let's crack on with updating all the paths and getting things looking decent. 
Oh, actually, no. Let's do the border first because I brought a streamer. So let's get the border done first, see if we can cut it down a bit. And then we'll do the puffs. The grass is a bit wet, but we'll give it a try um, with the border. I want to cut it right back and then hopefully cover it with some weed membrane and then hopefully it'll kill all the grass off. And then come spring, we'll be able to make our own proper border. Okay, so it's looking half decent at the moment. I didn't bring me hammer, which is a bit annoying because I've I've um I got the landscape staples to help staple it in a bit, um, but I forgot the hammer. So let's see if I can just get them in by myself. I have to do one section at a time. It's blowing everywhere. Oh, jeez. Oh, right, I brought a brew with me this time around. I'm breaking everything, which is not good. Oh, after yesterday, I realised that I needed a brew, so... Let's sit on this broken piece of wood and have a brew. <sighs> Cheers. So the next job now is the the paths. Sort out all the cardboard, make the paths, and then get the wood chip on it. under an hour. Do you know, time just flies, it really does. Okay, let's finish this off and then get cracking on. I had to cut the video short as I was informed that the wood chip delivery wasn't for the whole allotment but just for one plot holder. I didn't realise that, I did apologise and then I felt uncomfortable doing any more. I hope you enjoyed today's video and seeing the transformation that's going on and as always, happy growing!